Another option for planting flowers in your garden is planting perennials. And perennials are flowers that come back year after year. Right here we have a peony, and this was a beautiful flower. It's, they come in different colors, and this one will come back year after year. So that's an option for you. Maybe you don't want to plant flowers every year. You make a small investment to put the bulbs or the plants into the ground, and then they come back year after year. We're going to go look at some other perennials on the other side of the garden. Another controversial plant that you can have in your garden is milkweed. Now, some people don't like them because they are somewhat invasive, but however, they do, pr they do attract beneficial insects to your garden. And they are a strong grower, just like, well, just like most weeds. But something to think about, you know, if you have them in your garden, you might want to leave them to attract the beneficial insects. But if you feel they're invading, then you might want to pull them out. Another great perennial for your garden that you could grow is roses. Now there's different, many different types of roses. There's a lot of different information on roses. We're definitely not rose experts. We just have them here in the front of the house. They just happen to grow. And they do require just like many perennials some maintenance. So that's something to consider as well. While you may not have to plant them year after year, you may have to maintain them. Roses are nice. They attract a lot of different insects and they smell pretty too. And, and they, they, look, they look nice as well. So there's many different flowers that you can purchase for your garden, whether you purchase them and plant them in the, once a year, or you buy them and they come up year after year. Something to think about when you plant flowers for your garden. For more information, please visit the WisconsinVegetableGardener.com.